All right, this is Matt Witten with North Texas Speed Machine. We've got a D16Y8 in the home that's got LA sleeve, uh, flange sleeves in it. And uh, right now, it's just getting honed out. We have about seven thousandths of an inch that we need to cut out, starting with the rough stones. I'm not torque plating it, partly because we haven't made one yet. And secondly, being flange sleeves, there's not really a lot of distortion caused by the, uh, by the head bolt holes like there would be in a in a cast iron block or a uh, sand cast block. So, here we go. Alright, so I'm done with the uh, the rough honing and I'm going to move up to a 525 stone which is going to take it to a little bit smoother finish. I'm about two thousandths away now and I'm going to take it down to about half a thousandth and I'm going to put in my fine stones at 625s and uh, you know take it all the way out and then finish up with a plateau hone. So, let's go back. Five Alright, so we finished with the 525 stones, now I'm stepping up to the 625, and I'm about half a thousandth away on each cylinder. Uh, so, uh, you know, this should be the last round until plateau honing. the fine abrasives and now we're stepping to the plateau hone. I like to use the bristle brush uh, simply because the setup's quicker and we get pretty much the same results. Uh, and this is going to knock off the sharp or jagged edges on the honing. 
uh, pattern that's in the cylinder. It doesn't change the bore size, it's just knocking off all the slurs.